All right, well, what we have here is a SanDisk Extreme USB 3.0 flash drive. Uh, the model number on this is SDC-Z80-032G G4-6. G now, the G4-6 on this particular unit here, if we can kind of zoom in over there to where you can see, that G46 simply means that this was packaged for Asia, Middle Eastern countries, and that's why I was able to pick it up a little bit cheaper than what you would find it at in a store. So anyway, this, this specific flash drive here is supposed to write at 100 megabytes second and read at 254, uh, excuse me, 245 megabytes per second. Out of 816 flash drives, this unit here is actually ranked number 7, which is pretty good considering that the only non-SanDisk Extreme flash drives that rank better than this, they're all very expensive, uh, 120 gigabyte plus flash drives, which is well outside of what I want to do here, uh, what I need it for. So anyway, what we're going to do here is we're just going to cut it open. We're going to get it out of this package and see what that's all about. Just follow the lines right there. Cut it right through. Easy enough. Now it should pry open. this aside and this is what we have right here the SanDisk Extreme USB 3.0 I can tell you just the way that that flips right there that feels so much more uh, well designed than a lot of other flash drives that I've actually reviewed so let's go ahead and take a look in the back here And close up on the front. Got a little loop there. If you want to put your, uh, you know, put it through a keychain. You can go ahead and do that. Model numbers on back. Uh, simply state that this is uh, an SDC Z80 dash. 032G. That's what I read on the back. So anyway, let me go ahead and reposition this camcorder here so we can go ahead and do a benchmark on this. Alright, now that we're repositioned over here we can do a benchmark on this. Go ahead and plug it in. It's just recognizing Just recognizing the flash drive here right now and it's showing let's see if we can zoom in on this here for you here it's showing uh, 29.1 gigabytes of free space and then let's go ahead and see what this is formatted as FAT32. Now the problem with FAT32 is I'm sure you're well, well aware of you can't write files greater than four gigabytes in size and considering that I do a lot of video that's just not going to happen. Uh, so what I'll eventually do is simply format this but that's outside of the scope of this video so we'll just skip that. And here what we're going to do is we're going to launch crystal mark here and E. We'll go ahead and do a quick uh, 100 megabyte test here.
Now there is a small blue light that's lighting up on this unit on the flash drive. Uh, I will say, I mean, if you're not right on top of the flash drive, you're not really going to be able to see it too well because the sides are actually covering it. But it does have a light, and that does light up. And you'll see those speeds right there, uh, very respectable. 161 megabytes read, 96 megabytes write. So we'll just go ahead and let this complete the test here. And if you compare that to a USB 2.0 flash drive that I went ahead and benchmarked not too long ago, you'll see that this is every bit of 10 times faster. So I'm definitely happy with what I'm seeing here on the screen uh, right now as far as the benchmark goes. I'll be able to transfer a lot of video much faster than using a USB 2.0 drive. And there you go. We have it. It completed that test right there. And what I'll do is a quick 500 megabyte sequential test here. We'll just go ahead and run that here so we can get an idea how well it works on larger file sizes. Yeah, very good speeds, 160 megabytes read. And 97.92 write. So there you have it. Uh, it's definitely a, a very good flash drive. One of the fastest units that I've got. And we've got a number of uh, flash drives here. Uh, if you can look on the screen, you'll see I've got an Asus uh, USB flash drive actually in the routers. That's like network storage right there. Uh, that can be swapped out with other other drives that I've got as well. So these numbers here that you're looking at, really, really nice speeds. <laughs> Definitely the fastest flash drive I've tested. I'm going to go ahead and put a link in this video uh, to the place where I purchased it at. If you like it, uh, you, know, you know, please check it out. You can get more details, you know, by visiting that link, getting other reviews. And of course, if this video here was helpful for you, uh, please go ahead and leave a comment, say hi. Uh, go ahead and like the video. Really appreciate it.